Hello everyone, Asher and Talon here. Welcome back to another episode of Black Mesa. Today we are picking up in Honor Rail. Progress so far has been reasonably good. Um, we got part way through Honor Rail in our last episode. Our health and ammo is okay. Could be better. Could always be better. But we'll make do for what we've got at the moment. I don't like the look of that. I think we'll take the uh, the long way up. Yeah, we definitely took the right approach there. Oh shit! Oh, that was unexpected. Cheeky, cheeky, cheeky. Let's see about taking some of these out if we can. Hopefully without causing us too much damage. Normally there's uh, there's marines in here, so this is a uh, wow. We see an unexpected plot twist. Well, this, that, that went badly. That just went badly. Frustrating. Alright, let's try that again. Luck's not on my side, clearly, today. Alright, let's shut them down. I think there's a couple more down the bottom, but we might be okay with those. Shut the lasers down for them at least. Much better. Much better. Took a bit more ammunition, but it was worth it. Couldn't really get a good position on those uh, the first time round to get the kill. Which is a shame, but never mind. We got there. Wait for it. There's much more reliance on turrets in this one from the looks of things. I know there were quite a few in the first one. In the original Half-Life, but uh, it seems to have been more recently. Where is that turret? I don't really want to be surprised, but there it is. If you face the other way, that would be great. Thank you. Yeah, you stay there. Duck! Did not duck in time. Should still be fine. They have put that laser in a good position. There's no way of actually ducking that one. Quick save through there. Oh look! Trade mines! What a surprise. Huh. Why did that only detonate one? They're right next to each other. Never mind. We will deal with a few marines now. I can hear it. Ooh, nasty. Bit more damage than I would have liked, but it's okay. Right. It's not too bad. Make sure we're not going to get ambushed while we're uh, having a look inside these crates. Being useful here. A couple of useful bits. That grenade was potent. It was uh, was much more expect, much more potent than I expected to be. And hey, look, they can actually spell in this game. Wonderful. To be honest with you, I wouldn't, don't really want to deal with either of these type of enemies. But I bet he just uh, had just enough time to say that's a grenade before he died. Him, his mates, and everyone in you. Just when I was starting to feel lonely. I almost put a I'm bullet in you. Fixing to throw you a surprise party. Better clear your dance card, slick. Okay. I think we can do that. 
Damn, I was hoping to uh, catch him before he could get me, but never mind. Hoping to get a headshot on that one. I don't think it went well. I'm actually taking a bit more damage than I would have liked, so I'm just going to see if we've got any health kicking around. There looks like there's a heavy battery in there. I feel like there should be a carpeted area in here. Far too easy to stain in the break room. Um, nope, nothing useful. That's a shame. Oh, fuck. Even less useful. Oh wait, I think I know... Yeah, there is a... F charger in there. Charge is empty, but at least the health is full. I thought there tended to be a... Collapsing section in here. Not in this, uh, not in this game, apparently. Shame, because I'm pretty sure there's some heav batteries up there. Let's let them juke it out for a minute, shall we? Boom. Couple more Marines. That was a headshot. That one was definitely a headshot. Is that the last of them? Yeah, it looks like. Alright, I'm going to grab some health. Good job I didn't stand in that doorway too long. There was an explosive barrel there that uh, you can't see from inside the door. That would have been pretty brutal. Could have stood here, they should have shot that. Game over. Gordon Freeman is dead. Again. So, let's have a quick look in here. No oh, balls. That would have gone better if... Oh, shit. <laughs> that would have gone better if I hadn't have picked up the gun instead of mounting the goddamn 50 cal. Bit frustrated about that because... I feel like if the gun hadn't landed quite as close to the 50 cal as it did, that would not have been an issue. That's cost me a lot of health. That may end this quite quickly. There is a first aid station over there, so maybe, maybe I can get something out of it. We'll see. There's definitely uh, less of a, uh, or more of an ammo cap on this game. Pretty sure you're allowed to usually carry more MP5 rounds. Still, I suppose it's like five clips, six clips, so... I was hoping this way might be the first aid station, because there was a door for it there, but uh, apparently not. Ah. Ah, ha ha. No have, but some more health. It won't take me full, but it'll do fairly... It'll get me fairly close. Ah, oh, balls. Still haven't quite learned that I need to keep moving with these guys. There we go. There's still ah oh, brilliant, there is still a head battery over there. And something else. Looks like it could be a grenade. It is, it is a grenade. Wonderful. That's what I like to see. So get us into the silo access. No sneaky trip mines in this run. But there's probably still a marine kicking around. So, gotta be careful. That's him. More than one. Find some cover. Oh, shit. I feel like I could have done better with that. Maybe I should have used the MP5.
That one went better. Although I thought he threw a grenade. Yeah, he did throw a grenade. Nope. More ladders? Is there another ladder? There is another ladder. Great, I'm going up. Where are you now? Oh, he's up, up above us. I can see for a second. Got him. Only took a couple of shots to the face there. Could have been worse. Launch platform console remains locked until all work platforms are lowered. Shit, so we're gonna have to go down. And uh, start these from scratch. I should have read the instructions. Always read the instructions, people. Always read the instructions. Have to go all the way to the bottom floor. Oi. Is that the last one? Is there one below us? No, this is the base. Okay, good. So, let's get up and start lowering these platforms. Number two. Number three. That should do it. Brilliant. Lift and shift. Missile's on its way up. At least get it in a launch position if nothing else. Bit of ammunition and a grenade. How am I going to get out? Do I have to go back down again? Wait until this is in the optimum position, and then have a have a look. See, great missiles ready. Sounds like there's a door open there wasn't open before. Attention, satellite rocket silo reports status green. Excellent. Oh, health and have. Is that going to be... Nope, good. There's nothing between us and that. Just what we need, just when we need it. Lovely stuff. Should get us most of the way up for both health and armor. Health and have. Wonderful. Alright, quick save and on we go. I do feel like there might be something bad coming, though, uh, given that those things have just clicked off. Normally there's health and ammo and armor just before a fight. I'm gonna let that uh, raise by itself again, because it worked pretty well for us last time around. Sort of guard at the top there. Oh, we're almost outside. This is uh, this level has been heavily redesigned. Not a bad thing. Not a bad thing. We feel like the level goes on a little bit too long. Half expected to be ambushed there. I'm kind of surprised that I wasn't. Disappointed? No, just just very surprised. Making it slow because I don't know what might be up ahead. Anything could be hiding in these crevices. Let's go and have a look, see, shall we? Yep, thought so. Oh, fucking hell, he's got some knockback on that. I don't know if I can hit him from here. Nope. Right. I will make a jump across and see if we can deal with him from the other side. Oh, Jesus, that knockback's huge. 
was hoping I could knock out the light because that's going to make aiming difficult. There's a guard over there, I can see that. Let's see if we can find a way around. No. Lost pack. I feel like we're going to need that. Got a bit of a delay on his shots at least. Jesus, die! I missed so many of those shots, that was just stupid. Move! Fucking cone getting stuck on the cone. Alright, let's try this again. This is probably not going to go well, but hopefully it'll give me a bit more protection. How are you still alive? Okay, that went better. So, that's our plan in the future. Shit, there's another one. How did you... See, you guys fucking like it. Yeah, fuck you. Anyone else? No? Good. Yeah, if I have to do that again, charge in with the, uh, the train. And that should get me there. Let's see if there's anything kicking around. I could do with some health after that. Didn't go as well as I would have liked. If it does. Ah. Excellent. What a fortuitous placement of health. Just enough to get me full as well. I feel like I'm kind of getting through this game by the skin of my teeth. Definitely struggling a little more than I was on Half-Life, but I suppose at the same time that's kind of understandable. The game has been redesigned, the enemies definitely do more damage. So, who is this guy? Don't know how he wasn't killed by the first shot, but never mind. Forgot that I had a quick grenade throw there. So I'll throw a few out, hope for the best. There are quite a few out there. I feel like maybe I should have listened to the new dialogue, but at the same time, enemies. Couldn't pass up the chance for free headshots. Damn, that was my last magnum round. Grenade out! Need to move up, I think. See if I can get some closer shots because I'm running low on ammo. Jesus, there's a lot of guys. Got one. Might have got another. Either that was that that was the one that I just killed. It's a, looked like a guy on a 50 cal there. Probably not. At least if I run out of ammo, I should be able to get enough back from these guys. Let's change the pistol. Be a little more accurate. 
No, there's more down there. See? Wait for it. That all of them? No, fuck's sake. Alright, I think that's all of them. It's good, I was seriously running low on everything. Didn't go as well as I would have liked, but never mind. The door there. I don't know if I can get back in. No, okay, so I'm stuck going this way. Shotgun doesn't feel like it has as much weak threat as it used to. Ah, oh, I should have just come over here and used this to mullet everyone. Would have been much easier, but eh, never mind. Done. What's done is done. We're nearly at the end of this level, I think. So. Might make this a bit of a longer one as we finish up this level and then start apprehension fresh. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. Let's go on the Maganda's inside this little hero facility. Do do sneaky sneaky. Sign off shit. Monsters, hell yeah. But civilians? War of this damn operation anyway. Nice to know the Marines aren't all assholes. Having said that. Oh shit. Huh. They'll still happily uh, murder civilians. Didn't realize there was a window there. That could have gone better, I think. Put him in a melee animation. Excellent. Guys. Could have just left it, really. If you turned around and you'd walked away, I wouldn't have tried to kill you. Yes, I threw a grenade, but there is a wind in the way, and let's be fair, I've been hurt before. So, you know, I'm gonna strike first. Anyway. Sip of tea, full health, decent have. Let's see if we can launch that there rocket. I'm so glad they got rid of the stupid ass trap on the open opening door of this. It was such a pain in the ass. And it was not cool. I feel like we're going to get ambushed. Bye bye rocket. Nice. I love the remade launch lighting. That is beautiful. Make rocket go now. Beautiful. Right. I know these guys stopped the launch, but I kind of have to ask why. I know I asked this in the uh, previous one, but it doesn't make a lot of sense to me. I'm sure they'd want to stop the alien invasion, and the only way to stop the alien invasion would be, well, at the moment, to launch the satellite and hope for the best. But instead, no, we're just going to do all this shit. They have definitely heavily redesigned this level. I don't quite know where I need to go now. Possibly over there with the green light. Heavily redesigned this level, and I'm not going to complain about that. This level did go on a little too long. Could be a little frustrating. So, really nice that it's no longer quite that length. Take these fuckers out from a distance. Usually the head crab that kills you is the one that you don't see, not the one that's really far away. Nice grenades, shotgun shells. 
Lots of useful things. Pool of electric water. Hear a zombie. Pretty sure I hear a zombie. Anything else useful? No. Uh, I'm gonna say that that ladder there is where we need to go. It sounds like the zombie may have just got himself eat. What do we do? Start by killing them pits. So it's that sound. Is that just one of the limpets? I'm going to go with that old train over there being our point of exit. So, with that being the case... Oh, trip mines. Hold on, trip mines, that's a shame. With that being the case, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, I'll uh, hopefully see you for the next one. Till then, bye.